Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for November the 14th. Today, in 1501, Catherine of Aragon married Arthur, Prince of Wales, in St. Paul's Cathedral. Catherine was escorted to the cathedral by her 10-year-old brother-in-law, Henry. She was dressed in white satin in the Spanish style, and she wore a white veil covered with gemstones and with gold thread. Prince Arthur was also dressed in white satin. The ceremony consisted of reading the marriage agreement and her dowry, and then they said vows and had a mass. It lasted several hours. Then the conduits ran with wine, and there were sumptuous banquets, and the celebrations lasted for over two weeks with jousts and pageants. Of course, the main event would be the consummation of the marriage, and what happened on that night would be the stuff of rumor and debate for years. The woman in charge of dressing and undressing Catherine reported that she was very sad that nothing had happened that night. Though, of course, there was the famous statement that Arthur made about being very thirsty the next morning as he had been in the midst of Spain. We'll never know, of course, but Catherine swore until her dying day that nothing had happened with Arthur. That's your Tudor Minute for today. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com.